All right, just put this in here. We're just gonna keep it here so that when we move out, we have the stove to get rid of. He wants to buy a dryer. I really don't wanna do laundry here, so we're really not gonna focus on laundry. We're focusing on getting a alien. You love the stove or you love her story? I'm a little bit confused. Um, did anyone say you could just sit down and, you know, watch some TV on my TV? Or did you decide that? Because I'm really feeling like you decided this. He also wants to learn the logic skill. So maybe we'll take him back over to the lodge and make him sleep there again tonight. <laughs> I'm trying to get this charisma skill, but it just feels like it's taking it forever. Um, you had like six dragons for no reason. Nice. Welcome back. Alien love. Yeah. How many? We gotta find space rocks. I just, I'm not really sure where the best spawner is in town. And it's gonna be so hard to see it now because this town is kind of dark. At night, it's kind of dark. I mean, I can kind of see, but I know you guys can't see at all. There is a rare seed, another rare seed, another, oh, this is a special one. I don't know if I should get it or not. So we're not really going for special, we're just going for items that we can eat and stuff. So, I don't know. We will see. All right. Moonzy has gotten on her own to feet. All right, that's fine. Uh, that's an unknown. Mmm, not really seeing anything. Yeah, see, look at this. Skill increase, like, summary active s career slacker. We don't normally get that because I told it not to run. So it shouldn't be running, but it is. Oh, The Sims. Alright, well, I guess we'll just continue working on the... Ooh, we got our skill. You can stop now. Perfect. He just grasped the basics of charisma. I love how the house and everything was loading up when I came back. And he actually wasn't even in that photo. Good times. Alright, so we are going to go back to the lodge, which is right here. So I'm going to have him visit here, put it on fast speed. So we're not waiting a quadrillion years for him to get here. All right, let's see. I want to go up. I want him to practice chess. Wait, did that say challenge someone to chess? Challenge Carly Rue Ruse to ch a game of chess. We could, but I'm just looking for the skill. I'm not really looking for you to challenge anyone. I need to go home now. Bye. Yeah, get out of my house, freak. Stop watching my TV. Um, <clears throat> Mendenza is so rude, running up electricity bills for no reason. <laughs> he totally is. Oh, okay, go eat. Don't eat the brownies. <laughs> One fifty-two. You want to buy a chess table? Okay, we could totally do that. You can totally stop doing this because you just grasp the skills, so we don't need to do this anymore. Yay! Good times. All right. So, is there anyone downstairs? No, but this music is popping. Like Mary Poppins on a Sunday afternoon. I don't know why I just said that, but I totally did. Totes just said that. Alright, I'm gonna let him sleep. Because I don't really see anyone here to communicate with. Poor guy. Poor guy is all alone. And he's so lost with all of you, without all of you. Haha.
get him a lady friend. Yeah, we're working on badges and we're going to be working on getting him a alien lady friend. <laughs> so we've got to find a way to get an alien and bring it down on the house so that we can have a baby by her. Because we're working on our badges. Well, I'm working on my badges. We're all working on my badges. But Yeppers, he will have a baby friend in, er, a baby friend. <laughs> he will have a lady friend in no time. Whoa, music's getting loud down there. And then he cracks up. Like, how was that funny? <laughs> Maybe he thought because the music was getting loud that I couldn't hear him. But I did. I think these beds are better than the one we have. I'm not really sure, but I think they are. And have babies because they're cute. Yeah, we're going to have an alien baby. Look at this music. It's really loud in my ear. Woo! Woo! <laughs> oh my goodness. It's getting even louder. I can't even go downstairs. Don't even bring me down there. I will follow you outside. Yes. Defeated the loud music. It was defeated. I've actually never had an alien. I've had babies, but I've never played with the families long enough to know, like, what an alien can do. So this is kind of a new thing for me in The Sims 3, and I know that probably sounds really ridiculous. But I just, I like, when I get a baby in the family, I just, I don't know. I never play it long enough. And it's so rare, too, that, like, you barely ever get one. I think I've gotten, like, one alien baby. I don't even know. It's a little bit redonkulous. Ridicuridonkulous. Okay, let's get him to eat some breakfast. We're going to have waffles. Actually, let's have pancakes because they don't cost money. Have pancakes. We should probably get him the chickens so he could get the eggs to make the waffles and we wouldn't have to pay for that either. That would be the smart thing to do, but we need money for that first. Because they only have 152 simoleons, so there's no way I am going to get chickens with 152 simoleons. And man, is it hot in here. Whew, I'm sweating. Alright, let's see. What if it's a man alien? Uh -oh. Then we got to go for a girl. Uh -oh. Ow. Just living at the lodge in <laughs> secret. Um, they don't have sleep. Aliens have brain power. Oh man, so this person's going to be up 24-7. Actually, that is probably the best person to play a live stream with. Because then we never have like the down times, if you guys know what I mean. Because we kind of have like down times with him. Like he goes to work, it's a down time. He goes to bed, it's a down time. So with that, it would be like less down time. We could always be doing something, especially if the person, the alien doesn't get a job. We don't have to stay with the alien. We can marry the alien as, you know, whatever. I have the baby. And then maybe as the baby's aging, the relationship with mom and dad kind of fall through. So we could do that or and get him with someone else. Or we could just let him marry this person and have the baby and just live happily ever after together. Who knows? Who knows how it's going to play out for poor old... Uh, Colin here. He just, he's not sure how his life is going to play out. Look how big this tree got. That's crazy tall. Yep. 
All right. Ooh, good meal, well rested, and squeaky clean. Who could have guessed? All right, speed you up, because you take too long in the garden. Garden. All right, you want to improve your gardening skill? We can totes do that for you. Totally. Can you guys speak like Stitch? I can speak like Stitch. I don't know if you guys have heard it before. But I can do it. Waha. I can also speak like the Joker from Batman, if you guys are wondering what I mean by Joker. I don't know what you guys watch. <laughs> I know you guys watch amazing Sims 3 live streams, and that's cool. Um, Special and Midnight Bean. I'm not really looking for the Midnight Beans. I'm looking for, like, lettuce, apples, uh, things like that. And I'm not really, not really coming upon them. Mm, let's see this one maybe this one right here which is a rare it should just spawn some more so that we can get some amazing things amazing things he wants to get a recipe didn't he oh no he wants to flirt he wants to buy a chess table and improve his gardening skill so you know what I'm going to let him watch... Actually, I don't think the gardening channel is even on this TV because it's so cheap. How redonkulous is that? Alright. Oh, wait. Was that bills or was that the newspaper? Alright, you got to pay the bills of 87 simoleons. Simoleons. Um... He wants to flirt with someone, which means we need to find someone to flirt with. But we need to find an alien. Alright, I am going to look over here by the criminal warehouse. A lot of times, a lot of stuff spawns over here. This is really the only spot that I know of that things spawn. So, yeah. Um, nope, don't want that. Ooh, we've got some gems. We're not really looking for gems, though. We're looking for space rocks. You got any of those for, for, for free? You got any of those available today? Come on. Do you guys know of any like popular places that things spawn in Hidden Springs? That would be helpful. I'm not really seeing anything, and I don't want to waste all of his time. So I guess I'm just going to let him... Wait, clean that thing. Clean that. Use it. Go ahead and take a shower quickly. That way you'll be doing some things while I'm looking around town for you to find you something that you can use for your garden or for getting a wife a wifey do maybe he doesn't want a wife maybe that's why he's like sabotaging the space rocks maybe he's trying to tell me something probably not I have a huge mansion of a house that fits right here on this lot as I use it in my Sims 3 story on Facebook. Mm. Yeah, I'm really not seeing anything. Um, hmm. Unless there's something here at the park. There's some fest going on? No. Seriously, there's nothing around this world. Alright, Colin's carpool will be here in about an hour. So, I guess I'm just going to let him watch some TV for a little while. I have no idea. Whoa, that's scary. Why do I hear like a zombie? Why is there a zombie? 
Why is Roberto Viga a zombie in my backyard on a non-full moon kind of day? I'm really confused. Okay. Well, you're done watching TV. Wasn't that a fantabulous show? <laughs> I thought you'd love it. Um, a marriage to fall apart in an interspecies tragedy as a hybrid baby struggles to grow up in a place not suited. Oh, when you put it that way, yeah, it is. That makes me sad now. <laughs> we don't have to get them divorced. It was just an idea. If you guys just wanted him to have, like, the baby and not, like, keep, like, the alien mom, we could totally do that. Or we can keep both. It doesn't really matter to me. Do aliens die, honestly? Because I'm a little worried that they're going to live forever. I think they might die. I'm not really sure. He is a workaholic. Just chill with your musicians. Don't go crazy at work. You're such a crazy man. No, it's okay. I like the story. <laughs> but it's a head ending. She's just pulling out her laptop. Why is everyone like dressed in green or brown? Someone's crying. Whoa. Romance is in the air. In the Vandenberg household. <clears throat> Rinald and Katarina are getting it on that's quite the romance over there they got going on <laughs> whoa I think there's a movie now what is this person doing who's this guy Oh, I was like, his name is on the margins? No, it's Ryan Anderson. There's Hector. Sir Hector? He's actually our boss. We should probably schmooze him a little bit more. I don't even think we have a relationship with Hector, really. <laughs> nope. All right, perfect. So it says, Colin's impressive performance is earned a promotion to stagehand as well as a bonus of 300. Now that you're on tour as a stagehand, you'll need to familiarize yourself with lightning equipment, sound boards, spare guitars, and most importantly, learn to do the microphone check. You're one step closer to the band, yet still impossibly far away from the stage. Colin now makes 30 simoleons an hour and works from four to 10. So he works an hour later and gets out an hour later. He also has left work with 150 simoleons today so that's great he wants to reach level five of the charisma skill Ooh, Billy Billy Basile Billy Basile I made us buy him this and lock that in because it's worth a lots of points invite Alicia over he seems to really like Alicia I'm not even gonna lie to you guys like there's gotta be some chemistry there or something they've been best friends forever Forever, whenever. Okay. Okay. So let's see how this goes. Let's get you home. He earned a promotion at work. Boom, chicka, bow, wow. He is excited. I'm excited. I'm excited to have money. Because then we can actually buy this chess set. 
Actually, I think they're really expensive. I think they're like 750 or something. I don't know how expensive they really are, but it seems like appropriate number 750. It's probably not even close to like the appropriate number. All right, I am going to see how much money he has got in his bank arena, or how much money they're worth, and I'm going to do this in buy mode. Boy. Um, I think it would be here. We get an outdoors one for 350 but I'd really like an indoorsy one. Inside one. All right, I guess we're going to go with this monstrous, monstrous monster. And I am totally going to recolor this. He's got 65 simoleons to his name. Do you think that's a good thing? Probably not. Oh boy. Oh no. Okay. Any time now would be great. Oh my goodness, this is taking way too long. Yay! We finally got it! Woohoo! Alright, we have 65 simoleons to our name, so there's no way we can buy a chair for this thing. So right now, that's all he gets. Okay. He actually just needs to eat. Or sleep. So I'm gonna let him go to sleep. Um... Really? Why did I just buy a chess table? Only because he wanted one? I guess I could get both, but I didn't know that. So that's exciting. Thank you for letting me know because I am totally going to get him a telescope now. When we actually have money for it. <laughs> Does, yeah, he only gets Wednesday and Sunday off again. Strangle me now. Wait, didn't he go to work last night? And yesterday was his day off? No, he, today is Monday. Wake up, friend. Wake up. Louis Sweet is getting pretty old and won't live forever. Mm. Poor Louis. Poor Louis. Oh. Hi, Kira. 2002. Okay. Sleep, sir. Sleep faster. Sleep faster. Alright, 6 a.m. is when you're getting up, so that's fine. We're going to come out here and we are going to tend to thy garden. Tend to thy garden. It's my Garden of Eden. What do you think? What do you think of my Garden of Eden? Do you like it? Do you love it? Do you want some more of it? Um... Oh, thank you so much. Uh, yeah, I've been on a little bit of a kind of, I guess you could call it like a mini vacation. Just taking a little bit of time to myself and to do things around the house that need to be done. Um, while I, you know, before The Sims 4 comes out, because it's going to get really hectic. Because uh, I'm going to be doing The Sims 2, The Sims 3, and The Sims 4 all at the same time. It's going to be really crazy. 
Um, so yeah, that's what I've been doing in my life. Um, Dancer Kira. Okay, that's cool. Yeah, I've been doing a few live streams. I did one yesterday and I did one a couple days before that. Um, I'll be doing one tomorrow. And on Monday, I'm going to be streaming for quite a while because I'll be streaming uh, The Sims 4 Cast. And then we will be getting into The Sims 4 and doing all that fancy, shancy, schmancy stuff, which is exciting. I'm excited. I hope you're all excited. Um, definitely, though, I'm going to be posting a update video with a few questions on my YouTube channel today. So, you guys, well, I mean, not today, but tomorrow, um, probably be up there. I don't know what time it'll be up, but it'll be up there tomorrow. Definitely make sure to vote on the questions because it's going to be really important. Um, and the special announcement that I was putting out to all of you, since you all are here, I'm going to let you know a little bit earlier. But I am going to be taking one of your Sims, um, and I am going to be putting them in my household. Um, and uh, we were talking earlier and voting on a few things, and it came up that some people um, wanted to do a boy-boy couple and then have a sister in the household. Um, but that's one of the questions that will be in the voting um, but I said if you guys wanted to create one of those people, either do a boy or a girl, obviously, or do one of each or do like 10 of each. It doesn't really matter. It could only be single sim households, but use the hashtag GBCLV for GBaby Challenger live, sh uh, live video. What did I do LV for? I thought it was live stream. But, I don't know, LV, anyways. Um, and I'm going to choose one person from that to be one of the people in the live stream for my Sims 4 live stream that's coming out in just a couple of days. So, if you guys want to get those in, definitely get that in as soon as possible. But there's some questions that I'd really like you guys to vote on. Um, I'm going to be putting, like I said, the update on there and you guys can vote for what you guys want. Um, and then there's like a couple of questions where you guys can just write like what you guys want to see or whatever. So definitely make sure to check it out. I may even try and get it up tonight for everyone just so everyone has a little bit more time to vote. But the votes and the characters, well the sims that you guys create, will have to be up by noon on Monday. So definitely if you guys want to get your sim in my live stream and I'll give full credit, I promise I'm going to just take them right out of the gallery on the stream so everyone will see that it's not my created sim, um, then definitely, definitely get them up there. And don't forget to follow me on the gallery as well so you guys can see like what I create or whatever because that's obviously how I'm going to be sharing my households with you guys. Um, so my households and my houses so that's exciting I'm really excited for that so yeah there you go that's my little speech speech um he has to work today right I think I think I remember him having to work um yeah today's Tuesday um oh I remember you yeah I remember you I remember my reoccurring friends. I sometimes forget some people who don't reoccur, like, aren't, like, reoccurring in, like, a lot of things. If you don't comment or on my videos on YouTube or if you're not, like, on my Twitter or whatever. Normally, sometimes I won't catch on to you, but if you've been on my live streams a lot and commented, then I definitely know who you are. Definitely. All right. He is just taking so long to make these pancakes.
I want my penny cakes, penny cakes, penny cakes, penny cakes back. <laughs> Strawberry penny cakes, yeah. <laughs> Take them off, they're good. They're good! That is so unrealistic, honestly. You would not pour hot food into your hand on a plate. It would burn. <laughs> not especially right off the stove. Alright, go ahead and clean that up. And then you should be good. While you're eating and cleaning up your plate, I am going to jump back out here. We are going to go look one last time. See if we can find any space rocks. Ooh, seeds. Special rare rare I mean I could pick up special but I'm not really looking for like money trees or anything I'm just kind of looking for stuff that we can use for cooking to make our little cooking prices lowered lowered down to the slippery town um ooh there's one Let's look and see what that was. That is a ginseng seed. Which we have ginseng. I just didn't plant it because I really don't think you can eat ginseng. I mean, I bet you you can eat it plain, like raw, but I don't think you can cook with it. Oh no, Colin is getting sick. No, Colin! Um, I'm going to let you play your guitar just because you need to boost that, that skill. And I'm going to look over here by the criminal warehouse one more time. Um, there's this one, which is... Ooh, pear! Yeah, let's go get that. Pick that up. That's perfect! Exactly what I'm looking for. If we can get stuff like that, we will be in heaven. In heaven, shplevin. Fee five fo eleven. I am such a crazy person. I know. I apologize. I apologize for my craziness. Um. I could pick these up, but I really don't want to. I really don't want all these rocks. We've already got three iron that I don't even know what I'm gonna do with because. We really don't need him. Alright, he's up to gardening or guitar skill level three. Let's see. Here we are. He needs to be up to a six though, so that's not that great. Alright, I'm gonna send you home. Um he has pancake pancakes every day. Lucky butt. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he does. Only because they're free. If I could get free pancakes every day from just having fruit in my refrigerator, that would be amazing. It would be amazing. I would probably eat them for lunch, breakfast, and dinner. Which I... Now thinking about it, makes me want brownies. I don't know why pan talking about pancakes makes me want brownies, but it did. Maybe because I'm talking about breakfast, lunch, and dinner. You could eat brownies for breakfast, lunch, and dinner, I guess, if you wanted to. It's up to you. It's up to you. What you want to do. Alright, I am going to plant this. I'm going to plant it right here. <clears throat> I am starting to lose my voice. I don't know if you guys can tell, but it's like going all wonky-doo while I'm talking. It's crazy. Alright, and I think his carpool is going to be here in about an hour. I forgot that it comes an hour later, but that's okay. Alright, so I guess for just like an hour, he doesn't really need anything. So I'm just going to let him watch some TV again. And I am going to put thy blueberries. Ooh, these are good blueberries too. Um, I'm going to put the blueberries in the refrigerator. Okay, there we go. 
<laughs> True that. <laughs> Man, it seems like I can never give this guy any money. I swear, you just had money. What do we spend it on now? Honestly, what do... Oh, the chess table. I forgot. Alright, let's go ahead and speed you up, friend. <laughs> Alright, you are good to go. Oh wow, we are still on fast. I don't want to be on fast. Alright, chill with your musicians. You should be good. You do need musical skill, but your band members is really good. That's a good thing. We gotta get up some more, though. Your boss. Let's see. Does this one work kind of his boss? Mm, no, I don't think so. There is Mr. Hector Mendoza and himself. That's what you're wearing to work? I guess so. I've never seen them wear their everyday to work before. So that's a little bit different. <laughs> Look at these two. They're still over here flirting. Oh my goodness. Look at that. What was that? Is that just some random person that I can't see? That is creepy. What is going on over here? Oh, there he is. He popped in finally. His name is... Floyd Burleson. No play guitar. <laughs> oh, I should have played guitar. Shoot. He is doing well at work, so that's exciting. Though he is in need of the musical skill. Well, we'll get him there. We will get thy man to thy skill he needs. Alright, let me just quickly save because it's been quite a while. So I am going to save this. There we go. Save it up. Alright. That is saved. Alrighty. I, see, I told this no and it's still going, so I don't get it. Just listen. Got a listening problem. 
please, no ego. As a stagehand, it's important to remember that a microphone check is just that, nothing more. A quick look at Don't Upstage the Band will help focus your efforts where they need to go, which will ultimately improve your job performance and help your, your relationship with your boss. Read Don't Upstage the Band and return to work to improve job performance and increase your relationship with your boss. Absolutely. Who wouldn't want to do that? They would be crazy. Alright. So it looks like story progression is just deciding to take over now and not let the game do what it needs to do. What ifs? Alright, let's see. Okay. Uh oh. That's sad. Colin got 179 simoleons. Somebody is breaking up with their significant other. Um, uh, okay. Let's get him to eat some dinner. We're gonna have some, ooh, let's have some spaghetti. My husband loves spaghetti. Okay. Aw, Lewis Sweet has passed on. Hmm. Hmm. Um, you do need to clean that as well. guys saying anything? Nope. Just so quiet. Um. <laughs> Seriously? We just bought him this better stove and then he goes and does that. Clean this up. Okay, and then let's go ahead and have some dinner. We're going to have some sushi this time because you can't mess that up because you don't have to cook it. Okay, why am I getting this spawning every night thing? It was a glitch that you got when Seasons or Supernatural came out because it was like your older games it happened to. But this is a new game. I just made it yesterday and I'm getting this spawning every night thing. Am I going to be able to deal with this? Probably not. I'm probably going to shoot all the zombies. All 
Alright, so you got your sushi. When you're done, clean that up. You also need to clean up this stove. And... Do you need to clean anything else? You need to clean your shower. And then, you can jump into bed. Mm. Jump into thy bed. Who is still here? Anyone? No one? Everyone? Nobody? It says... Cowboy and... Ringer rules. Okay. Alright. Alright, so I guess everyone else has left. Speed you up. So, since Ring of Rules, since you've already um, answered the questions, I am wondering if Cowboy wants to answer the questions in... Like, now for the Sims 4 live stream, if you're going to be watching it, definitely, definitely you should answer them. Or if you want to wait until the update video, because I think I'm about to end this. So, if you want to answer them now, I will stay until you're done answering the few questions that I have. So, let me know quickly what you want to do. If I don't get a response by the time he wakes up in the morning, then I am going to just end the, the live stream. And I know that it's like behind me, that's why I said until he wakes up in the morning, because it gives you a few minutes. Oh wait, today is a full moon. <laughs> Okay, that's fine. 75 degrees Fahrenheit outside in The Sims. It's crazy. It's so quiet in here. Oh, looks like Cowboy left. Okay. Well, that's fine. When he gets up, I am probably going to end this just to forewarn everyone because I am getting tired and um, I want to grab a little bit bite to eat before I go to bed. So I'm going to probably get off in just a little bit when he wakes up and then... I will pick up with him again tomorrow and have more pancakes. Um, oh yeah, we have to read this for work too, so read that. I don't think he works today actually. No, he doesn't, so you don't need to read it right now. We'll read it sometime in today. Actually, I'm going to keep it clicked on to read just for the sake of reading it because he does need to do it. I'm so indecisive when it comes to The Sims sometimes. Alright, so I am going to uh, save my game in just a split second. Um, and I want to thank you all for coming out and watching my live stream today. Um, definitely go to the update video. I might record it quickly right after this. Um, I'm not really sure, so we'll see. But it is going to be just the questions that I asked you guys in this live stream. And I'm going to check out the uh, personal message that I got for the polls. And I want to do that as well. So definitely go and vote if you really, really want to see what you want to see. Um, and I want to thank you all again for coming out tonight. It means a lot when you guys come out and watch my live streams. 
I hope to see you all tomorrow, and I hope to see you all again on The Sims 4 live stream because it would mean a whole ton to me if you guys could do that. Um, please don't forget to check out my YouTube channel at GBB Challenger and my Twitter at GBB Challenger. Um, so, and my Facebook page at GBB Challenger. Um, and definitely subscribe, like, follow, whatever it is you have to do. And that would mean a lot. So thank you guys so much again. And I will talk to you guys all in a later live stream.